my story is the story of an underdog. Uh, it's been over 10 years now, but when I left uh, Luxembourg, I had a well-paying government job. I had a career on autopilot, automatic pay increases, a house, you know, everything super stable. And I was surrounded by people who were complacent and everybody was complaining, but only I was the person who said, okay, I'm gonna take this long sabbatical and go to the United States and go to university and start a new career. And now I, I have something that is many fold more rewarding financially and also in terms of fulfillment. And it's just something that people don't believe that you can make it. What do you think at the age of 28, you're gonna go back to get a bachelor's degree and you know, you'll be too late, you'll never make it, you're not smart enough and your English won't suffice. What's really interesting is that even people who are supposed to support you like friends and relatives they're the ones holding you back they don't want you to evolve and grow away so it's a very selfish way of holding you back and then when you make it i mean it is something that gives me so much satisfaction when i look back at those 10 years and i see that my former peers are still in the same careers do it, still doing the same things that they complain about day in and day out counting the days towards retirement. I was able to break free from that.